This is the flight review of my UMX Waco by Horizon Hobby. Um, brushless edition. I uh, just got done with the maiden flight. I really like it a lot. It's capable of a lot. It's very scale. It's very slow. It's very fast if you want it to be. Has AS3X just like all the UMX stuff of today. It takes no distance to take off and very little throttle. Just over half throttle and a little bit of up elevator. A little bit of left rudder. And just jumps right in the air. Full throttle would make for a nice short takeoff. And it flies very smooth and very slow. That's downwind. Here's upwind. And your turns uh, coordinate a little bit of rudder, not a lot, unless you want to swing it around real quick. Just enough. If you don't want to use rudder, just be ready to bank and yank like that. A little windy. AS3X helps with a lot, a lot with that. My bigger planes, I don't use gyros, but these little ones, the gyro helps immensely. Now you can do basic maneuvers with it. Loop. snap roll, but you can even get crazy with it. Which I love about it. I love that it's got a very wide flight envelope. Enough power to pull out of a hover and get into one which is nice. Flying behind my back, never a good thing. <laughs> but the low and slow, I don't know why, I just really enjoy it. Speed pass. The roll rate is just perfect for this plane. It's not crazy fast, it's not overly slow, just right. Inverted, no big deal. Just a little bit of back pressure is all you need. Look at that, just pop right out of it. I do have my elevator uh, set to the closest hole to the control surface, just to give myself some more control authority for some not so scale maneuvers super tight loops. <laughs> or you can do long lazy loops.
flat turns. Very flat, not much aileron or elevator correction needed, which is nice. Try flat turn the opposite way. <laughs> a nice touch and go right at the end. Pretend I meant to do that. This is uncut grass. I'm actually surprised it didn't flip over when I hit the grass. That's pretty cool. Well, there's my timer. Yeah, you can hear it pulsing. Yeah, this is a great plane. The only thing I can't get it to do is knife edge very well. That might just be me not being used to the plane yet. Try a landing. Zero throttle, flare, no big deal. Grand handling is fantastic, tight turns. The only thing I did notice is, and this might be true with any UMX plane, um, when I unplugged the last battery I used and plugged in a new one, I didn't turn my radio off. I just cleared the timer and reset it, and the plane sat in bind mode and wouldn't bind to the radio. So I turned the radio off, turned it back on, and then it bound to the plane. So you may have to reset your radio every time you change your battery. Honestly, that's good practice anyways, uh, even with your bigger planes, because that's just getting a solid link rather than just leaving your radio on. But just bear that in mind if you buy one of these and you're having issues when you swap batteries, turn your radio off first. Well, unplug your battery, turn your radio off, turn your radio back on, plug your new battery in, and you should be golden. Um, but yeah, it's a great plane. I have no complaints about it other than not being able to knife edge, but that might just be me. But let me know if you have any questions down below. Thanks.